Motorsport brake failures and sticky throttles. Let's have a look. Giving us some phenomenal moments and now a phenomenal lap time from his boy Giuliano is ooh, just ooh, 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 ooh. huge crash for a Lacey who had just posted the second fastest time. It's great to see that Giuliano is he doesn't <laughs> he wants, wants to get out on his own. Heading Show this fine. Turn. No real there's the the lockup is late. The lockup is ooh, really it's not late. good. Look at the angle. You don't want to head on. In the air by the curbs, so the curbs are not an issue. It's just got nothing. Both front wheels locked and then straight into the tyre yeah. barrier. You can see with real force. Oh, that oh, hello. is the Bentley of Alvaro Parent. Wow. Bentley. A huge incident there. That's and you got to think like that perhaps that's in a braking zone there. Looks like he went that's a mess. on too. And you see him getting out of that Bentley. Just a miserable weekend for Alvaro Parent, and the good news is, is he's crawling out of his own power. We get to see, yeah. So he'll come in at the bottom of the screen, I imagine. Oh, yeah. Whoa, that's a that's runoff and a half. So ever. Yeah. He's yeah, done he that. Oh, wow. In and what that catch bent has done well there. Just, just that is what, just what, a, what a great job. Oh, that's a oh, fast yeah. crash. Just, just a just miserable just feeling, too, as a driver having a brake yeah. problem and a brake failure. The FPM no, thanks. The Pro Drive Racing Australia. Ah, the Aussies. Uh, Mark's talking about him. Oh. Exactly sure. <laughs> Five, oh, and he took out the leader as well. Jack, that's an enormous hit to Lee Holdsworth, who had no idea Nick Perkat was coming. At undiminished velocity across Jesus. the sign at the inside of turn one, and you were speaking about braking. I think there was none failure. of it going on there. That's either a brake failure or a stuck throttle. Nick did his absolute very best to get to the inside, but unfortunately tagged Lee Holt. That's taken the wind out of him. Good to see him out of the car. And there's Nick. So he's pretty keen to get over to Lee and just let him know that uh, it wasn't him trying. No, no brakes. Oh, yeah. There you go. So Nick, clearly no brakes. And he's apologising to Lee, who was very much the innocent uh, bystander there. And on Todd Kelly. And you see that. Look at that. It took a great look. He's got nothing. He's gone to the inside to miss drill in the back of Todd Kelly. He's gone across the inside. Bang. The tire that is really he's unfortunate. The rear of Lee Holdsworth. I'd be surprised if we see Nick Perkat's car out for the rest of the weekend. That would have done a lot of damage to the left rear and also right up to the parcel shelf for that combo. Jeez. Is that the I went to school with a kid called Jamie Johnson. That is a big hit. That, I think that's in the 92. Well, down There's a lot of liquid upon the catch fence as well. Just stop. Watch this car move right here. Whoa. Something breaks on that car. He just clears the trap. Oh. That's all right. Jeez. Jeez, that's a horrendous hit. Contact. I say that's all right because it wasn't like engine liquid. It was like the foam and the... Climbs out of the car and says, yeah, guys, I'm Blimey. okay. 24-year-old lion from Mooresville now. Oh, big crash. Felix Rosenquist. Oh, my goodness. I bet I know where that is. I think that's onto the back straightaway. And what we've seen in years past is a driver hitting the right front on the concrete wall at the apex. Oh, bless him. And it looks like the front end of the nose pretty heavily compromised. Let's see if my theory holds true. So. Oh, boy. Almost went out of the park. It's interesting to see that IndyCar has the screen where Formula One has the halo. Ooh. Holy cow. The throttle. That wasn't nice. Dead. Here's the long back stretch between the hairpin at turn 11 and the heavy braking area for turn 12. Who's not making the brakes? Mile long it's the red and white over here. No problem here. This is Tim. Oh, mate. Struck Can't get it stuck. Nick. Big hit. Big hit. You could see I don't know which way it's better to go into an impact. I would hope and assume that it's sideways, and he managed to get that turn. He just came into that brake zone and just wasn't slowing down. He ducked Just going into that head fast. No, thank you. He looked like he managed to get it sideways to go in sideways. That's a big hit. That's great news. That's really a Jesus, look at the state of the car. And the regulations and certainly the barriers in the runoff room here. Those barriers absorbed a lot of impact right there. You can see from the damage done to the barrier. He gets it sideways. Yeah, he does get it sideways. Slow the car as much as possible for impact. And that was the championship leader, I think, he narrowly avoided. So if he hadn't taken that action... He's brave because he... In the gravel as well. Yeah, you know, he's going forwards a long way. He was a driver right there, but really he can't do anything but hold on. To get it sideways into the gravel with the hope the gravel slows him. Bang. Yeah, that's a much better impact than a frontal, for sure. 
I, I feel like I would practice on the oh, Formula E rather than the clean side, but I don't know why I think that. You can see the, the difference. Who's not going to go? The difference between the clean and the dirty side. Ooh, right there, ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, straight on. Into the How did the camera that's right there not catch that? Holy smokes. That was big. Is it a, I think it's Eduardo Mortara yeah. in the Venturi after the practice start, and he's gone straight on down at, uh, down at the first corner then. Yeah, I'm thankful and grateful that, uh, that, I, I, that I don't have like basically uh, several uh, severe injuries. Or anything I mean, it must be sort of really scary as a driver when you're <laughs> flying full pelt into a wall. Oh, really? You think? <laughs> Newton in back going, oh, something's gone wrong. Newton out of control. Ooh, Jack oh. out of control and head on into the fence at very high speed. Is that the same place that the overcar did it? Trying to get out. Now, you saw how he... Yes, he's, oh, he's hit there with phenomenal speed. And we've got a big problem for Macaulay Jones is in the wall hard. Oh, what a mess. Huge damage on the back of the car in the escape area. Damage around the back end of the car. The good news is that McCauley is out and OK. Wow. Yeah, the rears are locked. I think something's failed. It's heavy. Oh, they cut out. I wanted to be on board for that. That first impact looks nasty. David parts in the court, but nobody does that anymore. They want oh, and he bangs the supercharger right off of the starting line. It's a good thing he was on a single run. He'll advance to the final four, but that crew will have a lot. There's one car you won't want to hit the wall in. Donnie's waving his hand. What's going on? Well, the engine is still running. He's actually trying to stop the car. He cannot stop the car. Evidently, the blower lifted off the manifold. The engine is sucking enough air and fuel to run maybe oh, 80, 90. 80 miles an hour. Who knows? He is oh, nice. a problem, Steve. He is picking up speed, even though the parachutes are out. He is going into the sand trap. Oh, my. A disaster for Corey McLennathan. I've never seen at the end of a drag strip watch there, you know. Well, Corey, you knew you had a runaway car before any of us did. Yeah, I mean, in that, something in that case, I didn't know what to do. I couldn't unstick the throttle. I pulled the parachutes, I did everything that they give us for safety-wise to stop the car other than using my feet, you know, I don't know, that wasn't a dang thing I could do. I didn't want to go through the parking lot, it might hurt somebody else. I had to hell. make these things for it, drive it right through the sand. You did a fine job. Thank you very much. Blimey O'Reilly. That was interesting, there was some nasty incidents on there, but that's what you expect, I suppose. You've got a sticky throttle. Just watch you guys. Peace.